Hello everybody, welcome back to Wizard of Legend. It's me, Slow Wolf. And uh, I'm in pain. To explain what's going on, I've uh, I've hurt my back again. It's not it's not fun. Uh, I don't know how this time, but it's the same injury. So I feel like that just made things worse, if that makes sense. Anyway. I'm currently in the mood to uh, just do some random runs. Hard mode can go ahead and uh, heck itself for right now. And um, as a result, it doesn't really matter what I pick here, does it? But just in case, I'm not picking that one. I'm not picking the hard mode. The, the, the insignia of legend can go ahead and bite me. All right, go ahead and pick up the gold. Go ahead and pick up the randoms. Yes, there we go. Let's go. And we are frail last, Atlas middle. Zeal in the first. Alright, that's fine. It's not that big of a deal, honestly. Oh, this on the other hand is a big deal. Alright, so receive signature charge when healed. Potentially neat. And then, like, the wind out. Like, the wind group, apparently. Like, we've just got wind everywhere. Gust plus this. Scales of Babylon. And Cyclone for a signature. Uh, I have not used Cyclone as a signature often. If honestly at all. But it seems to be working okay. So long as we keep ourselves a little bit more uh, spaced out and we give ourselves the room necessary to really kind of work things through. Why are there four of them? Or does there have to be four? Does there have to be four? Get out of here. I need one of you dead about pronto. Thank you. Much appreciated. Scales of Babylon to help speed things up a little bit and then get in there. Thank you. So one thing that this run has going for it is that it has extremely low cooldowns. We uh, we do not have an issue with longer cooldowns at all. And if I'm doing this properly, honestly, I should be uh, cycloning, like cyclone boomeranging, then scales of Babyloning. That way, it's like, hey, look at that, I got double, you know, boomerangs. But the problem with having double boomerangs is that the boomerangs have such a low cooldown that I almost don't care to begin with. I am mad that I got hit by that, but okie dokie. The main thing with uh, Scales of Babylon is that it gives us a huge speed increase. So long as it hits something, we get a massive boost out of it. We become much harder to hit. We become uh, very aggressive. Like, we have the ability to do whatever we want whenever we want. That's all good news as far as I'm concerned. But it does require a little bit of... get him so that's the combo I was thinking the trick is that we have to be able to land that combo frequently and I'm mad you got me honestly and truly I'm upset that you got me but that's okay uh, we got a little bit of heal there which is I mean nice we get we did take 25 damage at some point okay Look, I'm not going to lie, some of these seem like good ideas. And I usually take Broken Plague Flask. But the reason that we uh, need to kind of be careful about picking up those items right now is because we're playing as Venture. Venture means we have lower HP, but everything else is a little bit stronger. This is all well and good, so long as uh, everything else tends to like be strong enough to begin with. I... My point being, we don't necessarily need a lot of relics or items. What we need is just good play. And we can use good play to make the best use of our uh, of a cloak that is, outside of the reduced HP, actually a little bit broken. You what, mate? Excuse me? Pardon? I'm upset. I am upset that we just took all that damage. But okay, sure, fine. Whatever, it's fine. It's good. It's real good. Well, I'm mad about that, too. Okay, I ate that fire in the in the in the face. That's that's bad news. Don't do that. Why? 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 Just why? I'm so confused and mad about that room, and my nose is half plugged, and like I my back hurts, and just ah! I'm so upset with everything right now. Just I need a little room game. A little room would be nice. 
So, uh, what do we need? HP would be great. I would like to find a shop. Singular. One. Uno. Like, that's all I need. Oh. My God. Okay. Sure. That, that works too. Don't worry about that. It's all good. I need a shop. Singular. I need a brain. Oh, good grief. Fine. I'll pick it up. It's actually helpful. Everything else there is like, yeah, okay, but... Alright. Ooh, look at that. We got some stuff here. Regenerative Inkwell might be handy for us, but we actually like our signature overall. Just give it to me. At this point, I'm upset. Because I'm dumb. You dodged out of the- You what? You son of a- I am so mad at this guy. I am very upset at this- Unbelievably mad man. We still took him out, but it wasn't an incredible cost. So we got a little bit of a, a bulwark there. That's very nice. I appreciate that. There's nothing else on this floor for us. I, I've stopped caring. Hold on a second. When you get distracted by literally everything, and nothing makes sense, and your brain's overloaded with just nonsense, and you don't understand why... Yeah, uh, you you try doing commentary on a video game at the same time. Good lord, I'm having a rough time today. Like, just rough, rough days ahead for me. Okay, just keep it at it. The, the wind spinner is actually very strong. You are not yet dead, and I'm upset. That's okay. We got through that, at least. Look at us. We got through a room. I am mad that you were not stunned after I defeated all of your summons. I definitely pointed that in the other direction. I'm a little upset. I definitely pointed that in the other direction. The fact that I was not pointed in the other direction as a result makes me a little angry, but okay, fine. Oh good, we found the freaking boss fight first again. What else is freaking new? Okay, if, honestly, if there was a reason to do the extra skulls on boss fights, other than, eh, it's harder, I'll do it for that sake, then, yeah, sure, why not? But, like, as it stands, why? Why, why would I ever want to do it? Okay, everybody there dies. It's nice. Now, it's worth mentioning we do still have a combo here. With uh, all these different spells that we have going on. Thanks to the low enough cooldowns and all that stuff to do to venture and the damage we're actually dealing. and The fact that this Wind Spinner uh, attack is actually incredible. Managing to make some sort of difference here. Please die. That took way too long. Um, we are managing to turn things around in a certain sense. I is it enough? Can we uh, can we be proud of what we've done yet? No. Not even close. We're on the second level. We have so much left to do. We can't take last cannon. It reduces our HP at the cost of what? Damage? Give me Alchemist Stone, though. Any day of the week. Sure, we're down like what six chaos gems. We don't, I don't, I don't care enough. I dispute that one, but okay, sure. So the reason why it's good that we've got the alchemist stone is now we have just more money. More money means hopefully we'll have less problems, and with less problems, you know, we'll have a good time. At least one, uh, one expects that much out of a, a more money, less problems situation like this. Uh, Puffy Parker, probably not my first idea of a great time. Limited edition robe, in our case, is actually good. It means we can't take more than 33 HP. We can then combine this with other red items to make sure that we don't actually take all that much damage. So if we see any more cursed items, you know what? Sure, bring on the double damage. I, uh, I welcome it now. Because we're not taking 50. No, we're taking a lot less than that. I mean, we're still taking more damage than we should, but, um... Uh, you know, it'll still be a little bit more feasible, a little bit more doable, a little bit more palatable. That's the word I was looking for. Uh, as long as we've got this limited edition robe. Uh, we do have an item synergy in the works. It's just a matter of finding the rest of the items in the cell. Oh my god! Really? Okay, sure. Let's just put in all the bad guys. Oh good, now they're all melee. Uh, oh, good grief, game! Yeah, give me a dash arcana that doesn't do anything other than uh, pull them closer. Yeah, that's exactly what I want to do. I want to bring them to my face. Let's go. 
while they're on fire. It's my favorite airborne slam. Look, you can't convince me that this is a good plan, but like after this floor, it'll be fine. So if you ever get the 200 gold for it, like sign me up, I guess. Which admittedly we should in a second, just because this boss fight will now be easy. I hope. Okay, Grand Summer. Got him. Get him. That was an excellent combo. And honestly, it was an okay boss fight. Not the best boss fight we've ever had, but certainly an okay one. Do we want any more of these items? Eh. No. Instead, give me this airborne slam. Let's go. I know that there's evading Zephyr there, but I need more, like, actual raw damage at this point. And yeah, sure, I could just go for a, uh, for a basic melee arcana build, but we've done that in the past with the uh, super punch and everything. And since I have low HP, and, uh, could I not, maybe? Okay. Get a little bit of damage there to start off with. Put out a cyclone boomerang to just help do a little bit of residual damage there. Get him. Decent. Decent. Especially considering that we're doing reduced damage. You're kidding me. Okay. Okay, good miss on that one there, Zeal. Uh, no, this is not good. We did it? Excuse me? I misplayed that one badly. And that one badly as well. That's okay. We still got the win. Um, we got a win, though, at a pretty severe cost. And then we got this. Ward of Stones, what do you do? Increases the damage of Air Arcana. Okay, so, like, if we use this on the Earth level, which is next, you know, everybody just deals more damage, th then that's, I think, okay. The trick is that we're going to have to use this when it actually does matter, and I'm not sure when this uh, Ward of Earth will actually matter. If that makes any sense. You know what I mean? I forgot to turn on my fan, and I'm sure you guys are noticing that, uh, as a result, my computer has decided that it is going to die. Don't worry, computer. I am dying for you. I am so unbelievably frustratingly, uh, hurt again, thanks to my stupid back. I am... I have more back problems than either of my parents, and I am half their age, pretty much. Okay, put this out there. Whoop. Boom. That worked. That's cool. Oh good, the boss fight first again. Could we not do that, please? I'd really rather not do that. Get him. Actually reasonable. Actually reasonable damage. And as a result of this Ward of Stones, I think we've actually found a situation where the wards are actually good. Like, they, 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 and it's not even like a ward of air. It's the ward of stones that's doing all this right now. That's fine. I don't mind. I like air arcana. The fact that we actually got this to work is kind of nice. Captain's ring literally doesn't do anything for us. Um, Tesla coil might be very handy for us in the future. Combo gloves does help us. Um, get that extra little combo in there. We'll think about it. Okay, well, we will, we will think about it. Because as it stands right now, I don't necessarily want to spend any money on anything that isn't a health potion. Like, we might have to, uh, eventually, and that's a, something, a little something I'm worried about. Nice kill. Oh, of course I wasn't done yet. I was lied to, obviously. What else is new? Ah! Get him. That worked out nicely. We still took out a lot of damage, but I'll take it. Oh, what are you going to take? Scales of Babylon, I bet. Nope, Airborne Slam. I paid 200 gold for a healthcare card. Freaking awesome. I'm so thrilled to pieces. I appreciate it. Very nice of you, game. Ah, I'm upset. I'm upset, and I have every right to be upset as far as I go. What? Where was my... Was I stunned out of my Earth Ward? I'm upset about that as well. What am I not upset about? That's a great question, game. I appreciate you asking these tough questions of me. Right when I'm in the middle of, like, actually living my worst life. 
Okay, put this out there. Put this out there. Then slam dunk him, except for get out of the way, because that one guy's just going to go nuts, apparently. Good lord. We just got HP from the doctor, too. And look, it's already all gone. It's already all gone. Oh, what are you going to do? More dash. There's three... Di there are four different dash arcana for sale. Amazing! It's almost as if this game knew exactly... You what, mate? It's almost as if this game knew exactly what I didn't want for breakfast. Okay, put out one of these, then put out one of these. Then. You, excuse me, pardon. I would like to just make it well known at this point that I, uh... Most certainly tried to use my cyclone and boomerang, and then it didn't do anything? Okay. You tried to come from behind me, and I'm upset that you even thought about that. The fact that you landed that nasty attack leaves me feeling very upset. Okay, so we're badly hurt. We need to spend 50 gold on this. Sorry. Uh, we'll grab the Tesla coil, honestly. We could have gone for a melee centric build, but the Tesla coil here, too good not to. And then uh, and then we'll fight this boss before we lose any more HP to stupidity, honestly. Oh good, it's another rogue. I love rogues. They're my freaking favorite. Okay. Grab him. Where'd you go? There you are. And toast it. We actually took out the boss nicely there. And got some HP for it, and then with Ring of Recycling. What does that do? Gain a shield every time a charge signature is not activated, time runs out. Well, okay then. Allow me to not use my charge signature here then. Look at that, we actually have some HP in a sense. What a weird item. Uh, where else can we go? There's like a little bit north of the Arcana shot that maybe we can check out. And I'm not thrilled about buying anything here. Maybe the Toxic Trap, just to say that we used it once. But... Oh, right, that's it, huh? Um... You know what? Since Gust Dash has been largely scary more than anything else, I'm gonna go for Circuit Line Dash. Get me out of here. Like, it just... It's not anything special, but just changing that up might mean that we have a bit more defensive option going on. Like, being able to just dash away is nice and then if people follow us too much then they get zapped and hurt for it yeah i'll do that thanks it's, it's a little bit better for us than saying hey enemies uh chase me now i'm mad at the damage i just took again that's okay we're gonna go ahead and let this uh, signature charge also run out And since we don't have regenerative ink, well, it doesn't matter. That's good enough. Uh, oh no, not this room. I got poison. I got poison like a moron. And I'm upset because I got poisoned again. Okay. Thank you for eventually finally dying. Poison! It's one of those uh, status effects that I've never really liked in video games, but uh, here we are. Thank you. Uh, despite this fact, we still seem to be alive, and my salt seems to have been uh, largely misplaced. You know what? Don't talk to me about misplaced salt, alright? I don't want to hear anything about it. The reason why I don't want to hear anything about it is because... If I do hear anything about it, I'm going to be rather upset with the fact that I'm very bad at everything here. And you shot me? Are you kidding? Alright, look. Let this run out. Get a little bit more of a shield out of it, which would be nice. Do I want any of these? Tiny crocodile heart might kill us. But if we can manage to clear out the rest of this floor well enough, I'll take it. We don't even lose that much HP, all things considered. So, yeah. Tiny crocodile heart. Maybe it wins us the game. Maybe it doesn't, but I think in this particular case, it's a leg up in a way that I did not have before. Where are some, uh, some people to smash? Hey, smash! Oh, God. Wow, we actually got through it all. Except for you. Apparently, you're still alive. What are you doing still alive? Get out of here. 
All right, we got a lot of HP out of that. Very nice. No, not today. Yeah, okay, that's fine. This Ward of Stone, by the way, is doing a lot of work for us. I wanna make this abundantly clear. For without it, we would not have uh, half the damage we do curling. Get him. Yeah, sure, we could have saved that, but like, who needs that when I could have gotten like a sweet kill? <gasps> Lemo's Leaf, Pathfinder's Knapsack. We can go again for the combo gloves, which again would be helpful, but Lemo's Leaf. My dogs, Lemo's Leaf is probably the best 200 gold we could ever spend in this entire run. This is still the truth. Even with Tearing Whirlwind right, right there. It's right there. I mean, it's either that or Firewall, but Tearing Whirlwind, it's right there. I don't want a freaking Firewall. I don't need Firewall. Turn Firewall off. I'm down for that. I'm so down for that Tearing Whirlwind. Ah! I have to give this a whirl. Tearing Whirlwind is really good. Like, really good. It's probably one of my favorite spells in the game, bar none. Just gotta show up and people get uh, get all sucked up and stuff. Okay, we're gonna do this room. We're gonna do it easily because we have a controller, which obviously makes me the best at this video game. That's right. I am a master platformer in almost every video game I've ever played. You gave me Hunter Stiletto. You absolute fools! Do you have any idea what I'm capable of? Ow. Ow. You fools, though. Do you have any idea what I'm capable of with Hunter Stiletto? I can take on entire legions. And I know I just gave up Limo's Leaf. I'm an idiot for that. That's on me. I'm also an idiot for that, but don't, uh, don't talk to me about that, okay? That combo, on the other hand, makes me look like a genius. Okay, so how much money do we have? It's so close! Is there anything else left in this level that we have yet to explore? There's like nothing. We're at 98%. I know exactly where the last of it is. We need six more gold. That's it. We can pick up Limo's Leaf. Again, one of the best items in the game, as far as I'm concerned. You get a dash that allows you to dash through things. So how on earth are we going to get another six gold? I get the distinct feeling that we're not. And as real as that is, it does make me a little sad. Because I felt like we were so close to greatness on that front, and I wasted it picking up this spell that I like. What's more important? The ability to dash in a way that makes your dash a little overpowered? Or, or, just thinking out loud here, or the ability to spin to win. I have a feeling that the spin to win is pretty good. But Limo's Leaf is still better. Uh, Alright, so that's 100% of the level explored. There's almost not, like, there's probably very little else left to, uh, to smash or break open here for money. Which makes me a sad boy. Because I want that leaf so bad. I think we're done here. The area is so invigorating. I feel 10 years younger. Good. I mean, that's great. I'm, I'm glad that you feel that way. I think that we're done uh, on this level, and that makes me a sad man. So do I want any of these things? Eh, the short answer is no. Because right now what I want are things that allow me to uh, really abuse Hunter Stiletto, so anything that inflicts poison or burn or other status effects or freeze. Yeah, at that point, sure. Hunter Stiletto, then then we're good to go. That's, that's all I want in terms of relics. Other than Limo's Leaf, and we don't get Limo's Leaf, so everything else can go ahead and suck it! Alright, we gotta face Atlas, we gotta win. We can beat Atlas, but we need to be careful that our Wards of Earth make him stronger, too. So we might want to be careful about how we use those. Ow. Ow. Ow! I hate you so much. Run. Run, run. I don't know why I took all that damage, like, willingly. Get him. Nice, a dime. You can get a little bit of extra damage in with that, uh... Holy shit. Here it comes. Run. 
run. We're still alive. This is good. You're still alive too. And let's go. Kill him. He's toasted because we had a type advantage and we didn't screw up too badly overall. We did screw up really badly. I want to make that abundantly clear. We should not be alive. But we are because I opted not to use my Ward of Rocks, which if I had put it down, he had that one time that he dealt us 200 damage. Yeah, that was not so much fun. Or at least it felt like 200 damage. It was a lot of damage. All right, so now we're on the one floor where we don't do any extra damage. No one else does extra damage. And this is as neutral a floor as a floor gets. I'm mad because I was attacked by a ghoul. I did not like it, and I had to take it anyway. It's one of those moments where you have to just kind of accept what goes on. Which is not something I'm good at doing. I can't really accept things. I'm, I'm pretty stubborn. I don't like accepting, uh, you know, me being bad at something. Woo-wee! Get him. Nicely done. Just remember you also have that searing, that, that tearing whirlwind. It's, it's a really good spell. So as I was trying to say. We have a very real chance at this. And I don't accept, and I don't like accepting things very often. But in this one instance, I will 100% accept what's going on, if as long as it gets us to a point where we win. If I, you know, played badly or whatever, sure. I hate the solids. They all died because I used Ward of Stone way too late, but yeah, you know, I still hate them. Uh, okay, look, an upgraded Bouncing Surge. That sounds like a great idea, especially considering who we're going up against. So I'm actually going to go ahead and pick it up, and I'm going to use this to replace the Ward of Stone. The Ward of Stone's like, eh, yeah, it's nice, but you want to know what stuns people better? Electricity. You want to know what does damage as well? Electricity. You want to know what I can use against the Water Boss to do extra damage? Electricity. So, like, yeah, Bouncing Surge. Sounds like a great idea. We're gonna go upstairs now and head left, and hopefully my back doesn't just, like, you know, start killing me in, in, for no discernible reason. Oh, hi! Uh, welcome to the party! Jesus. I was gonna ask where you came from, but then you fell into the pit. And no one goes into the pit. Unless if they're a jerk. Which is why I've been in the pit multiple times in this episode already. Uh, not a dead end. Let's go left from here, I guess. Okay, goody. Goody. Gumdrops. That worked. I am surprised as hell. And this... Oh, we got extra damage for, like, all of our arcana. That's really good. You can suck it. You don't guarantee anything. Fine, we don't use you enough. Okay, keep your eye on it. Keep your eye on the card. It's in the middle. It's the last one on the left. It was the last one on the left. I might be very good at that whole at that whole uh, follow the cards game. I'm not saying I'd actually be able to beat somebody that's actually good at being able to play the game. And by play the game, I mean like actually abuse the fact that. People are gullible and. Whoo! Don't see sleight of hand very well. Like a person who's actually good at that would have a very different would have a very different time. Interest copper pipe, ancient fountain pen. I don't remember what the fountain pen does. I do know the interest copper pipe has something to do with electricity. And guess who has a Tesla coil and one electrical spell? Let's go. What does it do? Increase the duration of your shocks to ass effect. Yes! That is excellent news. So is that HP. Um my point being, if we can get this to work with Hunter Stiletto and everything else we got going on, we're going to be doing so much extra damage, just baseline, it's amazing. That felt good. I left Bumper game. I don't know what you read off of my controller, but I definitely left Bumper there. Doesn't matter, we only took a little bit of damage to our tiny little shield that occasionally pops up to say, hi, let's go ahead and do this boss now. 
So we're a little bit low on HP. We got the ability to make, like heal ourselves after this boss fight, but until we've done this boss fight. Oh god. Good hits there, honestly. Get him. We got him. We got him hardcore, no less. Alright, pick up all that HP, pick up all that sweet, sweet money. Go over here, spend 50 gold on that HP right there, and then look as you just get free signature charge for no reason at all, and then get the heck out of here. Is Tiny Crocodile Heart actually putting us above the amount of HP that we started with? Yes. Yes, it is. And this will continue. I think we'll be able to maybe get up to 450 HP, which would be sweet. Uh... Though that would take, obviously, a few more bad guys to do. Uh, it would be very nice to have. Uh-oh. Um, no, no, no. On so many levels, just... No? No? Thank you for dying. Okay, so that was a little scary, because I had no idea what was going on there. <laughs> oh, God, there's more. You give me a rewards card now? Game. I don't know what to tell you. The relic rewards card is not worth it. Unless if it ends up being Limo's Leaf on the final floor. The final game. Okay, look. We can actually sell that thing for money. That's le legitimately pretty funny. Is there anything else here that we're not going to be end able to end up using for the rest of our run? Healthcare. Uh, the healthcare card we can probably put away eventually. Everything else we're going to want to hold on to. So you know what? We've got options. We'll be able to make some money and make some purchases at the end of this level. And I know it's a bit min-maxy. That's why you're here. If you weren't here for the min-maxy, then why are you here exactly? Uh, this is the combo of the ages. That was exceptional. Um, let's please always do that. Anything that I just did right there, I need to commit to memory. Okay, out of the way. Do a cyclone boomerang. I'll get a kill on one of them. Stay far away for the other one. Thank you. Zap him. He's toast. So's the other one. Perfect. They don't got eyes on me anymore. It's Limo's leaf. You absolute madmen, you give me Limo's Leaf. Oh my god, it's a great day. We, uh, we want that. I hope that uh, is abundantly clear. Since we want that a great deal, what do we not need right now? Is a great question. Uh, the health card, probably. So I'll drop the health card over here pick up later if we need it bounce over here pick up the relic rewards card that someone so graciously gave us thank you random blue rogue go over here drop off the relic rewards card take it from me you fiend not bad you know what not bad at all is the correct answer then we run back over to the shop which admittedly is a decent distance but hey I would I would like walk 500 miles and I would rock 500 more if it meant that limo's leaf was inside that freaking store and now that we've got that we're gonna we're, we're not like set set but we are much better off than we used to be we can actually use dash to dodge things it's it's, it's good um, that was actually exceptional that was the most exceptional I could have asked that room to be I'm mad that I missed that one attack, but that's okay. We still got through it all. Uh, only taking one hit, no less. Get him. Get him. Yeah. <laughs> With 405 HP. Tiny Crocodile Heart, Tiny Alligator Heart. Which one is it? Tiny Crocodile Heart's doing a lot of good work. I don't know why I thought it was Tiny Alligator Heart for a second. Hoo-wee. I blame NL probably. 
Uh, I, he would be the number one person I think that would end up making uh, a mistaken nomenclature that's so insignificant that everybody else would get mad about. Okay, Ward of Lightning, absolutely not. Line Shock Agents, all this other stuff. Ah, I really can't afford to say yes to any of it. Like, why would I bother? None of it's what we've got. What we've got is doing gangbusters. Hell, even the Cyclone is, is a lot better than off than I expected it to be. Like, it's a good signature. I didn't know that. I'm mad. Because I felt like I was going to be able to get off my Bouncing Surge, and I did not. That made me sad. Uh, hello? Is there anybody up here? Ah, it's a boss fight. There's still another skull on that? I don't know what, where you get off thinking that that's fun and fair and balanced, but okay, let's go. Make it easy, back off. Get him. That was probably the single best stun I've ever had in my life. I used the scales of Babylon to push away all the bad guys. You give me spinning top now? Game, you can't afford to give me spinning top now. That's not... It's not in the cards. We didn't go for the, for the combo build. I don't think it matters either way. Like, we can probably get rid of the ring of recycling and it won't matter anymore. Um, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna quickly head over here. Excuse me for a moment. Grab an HP potion. Thank you. And then... Go back over here. Hello. I'd like you to take this card. How much is it worth? I'll buy that at a high price. Nice. Albert's formula. We're not likely to get a lot of use out of it anymore. So here, take it from me. Not bad, thank you. Was there anything else we wanted here? Reactive vine mail might be handy. We got room for one. Um, but uh, you want to know what? I've said it before. I'll say it again. Activation speed is hilarious. Now I feel bad because we could have gone for like the the Zephyr, like the the, the item that the spell that allows us to become like invulnerable as long as we're spamming this button, and we'd be set. So I just need to keep spamming dash all the time to move. And that's fine. We're going to be doing that against Frost Queen Freya anyway. So I'm not too worried. But there's a very high chance we die here. So keep that in mind. Nicely done. We're not out of this yet. Get her. Get out. That was a bad hurt. That was also bad hurt. This is bad hurt. Here's the baddest hurt. Oh, 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 oh god. Oh, Jesus. We got her, though. So, despite taking a ton of damage there, that was fun and... And not the worst thing I've ever done in my life. We also now have a ton of money. It's a shame we don't have Dagger of Midas this run. <laughs> so is spinning top worth it? Hell no. But like, we are able to just spam our spells now. And none of them really uh, overlap at all. Which is cool. Sura. Sura should be dealable with. We have a decent number of ranged moves. I knew that was happening. I knew that was happening. And the instant it happened, I was ready for it. Good stuff. Yeah, there. Shocking, I know, but like I seem to be kicking your ass, so that was bad damage. Shocking bouncers. Yeah, there we go. I'm pretty sure that that's like my new favorite anti sura spell is the bouncing shocking nonsense. Oh, you're still alive. I'm a little upset about that. I'm upset about that as well. 
Okay, we got that much done. We got some HP for it. We have less than 300 HP to take this guy out. We can do this. Just keep dashing. Good evade. I'm mad. Get out of there. Ah, I got frozen. Oh, I dodged through that. Dodged through that as well. Where are you going now, buddy? Guess what? You're not going anywhere. Ah, I get absolutely demolished. Okay, now get out of there. Good evade. Not good. Not good. Oh, good evade is good. No, that hurts. Oh, yeah, we didn't get that one. That's fine. Good evade. Not again. Mad. Mad. We're gonna lose. 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 We can still win this, but it's like, we're definitely gonna lose, though. Oh, I dashed into it. So the spinning top is what killed us, unfortunately. Uh, it was not worth picking up at all. So am I happy about this one? Hey, you know what? At the beginning of the episode, not so much. Uh, still kind of dealing with the pain and all that other stuff. Um... You know, plug nose. I was distracted. I was mad, but we kind of started turning around by the end of it, and it was fun as a result. You know, we had our uh, we had our time in the sun, and by the end of it, I felt pretty good. You know what I mean? That was that was okay by the end of it. But uh, as it stands for right now, that's gonna do it. Thank you all for so much uh, for watching. Hope you folks enjoyed yourselves. If you did, be sure to let me know. Hit the like button down below. If you want to see some more, subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications when these videos go live. I'll see you folks next time.